Extracurricular activities are what make us up as human beings, and they're really important in terms of our everyday life. However, when it comes to applying to Oxford, they're not quite as important as you might think. When you come and you see, go on college websites, you might see there's a range of activities going on. And one of our biggest selling points when we're talking to students is about the range of activities you can do alongside a degree. However, at the point of application, you've got very few words to actually sell yourself as a student. When we're making academic decisions, we're actually making them based on how well you're going to perform, the potential that you have to become and uh, a better learner, for want of a better word. The key thing to remember, I think, is that extra activities are something that we do care about in our students, but when you're making a, an application to Oxford, you need to make it as relevant to the course that you're applying to as possible. So for instance, if you apply for something like music, do mention your extra activities because it demonstrates the passion that everyone talks about when writing personal statements. However, if you're going to be writing a personal statement for another subject, um, and, but you're very um, accomplished in music, perhaps it's better that you use the UCAS form in a more creative way by moving all those qualifications over into the area called um, and designated for additional qualifications and concentrate instead on the academic aspects of your profile that will really bring your application to shine out slightly more by looking less at your extracurricular activities at the point of application and more on your academic credentials at that point. Thank you so much to Dan for agreeing to be interviewed. If you'd like to check out more videos about Oxford and Cambridge admissions, then check out the playlist that's on the screen now and linked in the description below. Also, take a look at the social media links in the description for St Peter's College, which is my old college. There are links to Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat and Instagram, where you can see a snapshot of student life at an Oxford college.